Norval Moriso isn't your Indian name, is it? What is your Indian name? Sean Batiste. When they knew that I was very sick, the lady came up to see me, the, our medicine lady. She came up and see me and gave me the name, Copper Thunderbird, Ozawa Kobnesi. And that's how I got my Indian name. Many names, many personalities, many signatures, each wrestling for the identity of this complex man. We're not all empty. There must be some, something good in that bear. That's even true. If, even even the picture, there must be something in the, you, I You've got your heart there, and i got my heart. Yes. There must be something there. And it always seems to be this em empty space in, inside of the fish in here. So finally, one time, as any uh, primitive person, I suppose if I was living 300 years ago, I would say to myself that fish is dead. And if it was, if, and if it has to have any kind of a magical meaning to me in order for me to catch that more fishes out of that picture, I thought I'd put the inside. So I started adding the ribs and the hearts and and so on so until I developed this this thing. But later, I believe it was called the X-ray design done by all the primitive people there is in the well in the world, I suppose, in general. But while Moriso presents us with images of the insides of the creatures he paints, it's much less easy for us to see into him, to penetrate his paradoxical exterior. I like your fish very good because it really reminds me, uh, I don't know, maybe I'm, uh, I live uh, Pisces, you know? You're Pisces? Yeah. That's what maybe that's why I like him. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's easier to draw too. Your dreams are very important, aren't they? Yeah. You dream a lot? I dream a lot, but I'm not, nobody's not going to fool me around. I know what I dream about. I certainly don't understand Norval the man after 13 years.